Hey guys, just Cassie here, and it's interesting to know that some people are still having issues with GTA Online. Now, me personally, I stopped thinking about it after the first patch because everything just seemed to run smooth. And plus, I have my way of working around things, so why the hell? Okay, I'm in game and someone called me and it just completely caught me off guard. But it is interesting to know. And I've just been still getting information that I just processed through my mind because people still comment on my previous videos saying this didn't save for me, that didn't save for me, this happened, that happened, and the experience just continues to go on. And so the only reason I didn't respond to some of those comments is because I really didn't know what to say. And if I started to respond to the comments... My answer would be pretty much the same for everyone. You know, I don't know. I don't know why this is doing this. I have no clue why this is doing this. The most I could probably say is maybe they're going to come out with another patch. And they did come out with another patch. And one thing that I am glad that they did is that they patched the amount of money that you pay every time you die. It was like a grand, a couple grand, or maybe it was a percentage according to... How much money you've had. Because I'm just wondering about what did, what about some people who may have had like $100 in their account. What happens when you have no money and then you die the next time. Do they just spawn you in the hospital? Are you in a robe being probed with a needle? I mean, Anyway, new problems have seen to arise. And Rockstar updated their support page no more than 5-6 hours ago. And it's interesting to know that... Some people are saving their games and their progress is not being saved. It's not as if it previously were. This is a totally new situation. The game will load up just fine. But let's just say that you earn 50k within your next game. You saved it, yada yada yada. You come back to the game and your game just hasn't been updated. Is that the current situation that it was before you started playing before you started doing your missions rockstar is saying that it's just a delay that's that's what they were saying one day it's just a delay and this morning i believe if i'm reading this article correctly or if i'm paraphrasing this correctly that everyone's items have been restored at least the majority have been restored because they have stated that they are still getting some messages saying that it's a little buggy and and yada 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 but what rockstar wants you to do is stay updated on their support web page i'm going to put the link in the description to both of these articles the first one will be the patch notes and the second article would be titled updated 10 19 13 cloud issues in gta online and i just want to say guys that if you're still having issues with gta online just understand that most of these buggy situations are just like stragglers like they're coming in late they're pretty much like the after effect of what they've done and just i just want to ask that you just be patient with them because just like any other game when bugs and stuff come out and when they have bugs and yada 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 and then they have to come up with fixes, they are unaware of it just as the player is unaware of it. So as soon as the player report most of these things, then Rockstar can get right on it. Oh, and another thing. You can receive automatic email notifications from Rockstar every time they update their information. All they want you to do is log into the support site and subscribe at the top of the page. But anyway, guys. I'm going to try my best to continue to stay on this. I have been slacking on a couple of days because I didn't know that today's issues were pretty much that severe. And I didn't even know that they patched so many things. You guys are actually going to see these things when I put in the description. Like I said, the patch notes are going to be the first one. The server issues are going to be on the second link in the description. Like if you haven't already. Subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps me out, guys. And thanks. Happy gaming.